A little bit of a delay there, that's okay. Good evening, everyone. My name is Heath Haskins, Code Primate, and this is Lumber Tycoon 2. Tonight, we're going to build, we're going to do something. I think I'm going to go for the Rookie X. So, huge shout out to Nathan, and to Tin Man, and to AG Gamer for joining me in the last game that was on a public server and everything else. I'm sorry the rock doesn't move. <sighs> Uh, I was like 25 minutes into the video, recording everything, and that rock bridge up there just does not move. It doesn't move. The The secret bridge. Um, if you guys didn't know about the secret bridge, um, you place a piece of TNT behind it, it blows up and it pushes it down, and it's supposed to be awesome, but it's not been working. You can't blow it up with the TNT. I just tried it with the, the truck. You can't push it off. I don't know. It's broken. So, oh. I, I, uh, we'll just long plank to it. Better we'll just drive off the cliffs over the edges and stuff. So, um, what was I doing? Oh, tonight we are getting that stuff. So, alright. Um, fastest way to get, I guess, would be firewood, but, oh my gosh. Shabby mill? That's not gonna work with a shabby mill. Um,. How much is the Salmax 2? Salmax 2 is like 19,000 or something like that. Um, think, 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 think. What's the most quickest way to get money in here by myself? All by, my, all by myself. Let's see. All right, that's the Salmax 1. This is the Salmax 2. How much is the Salmax? 15,000. We're 4,000 right now. <sighs> okay. So, let's just get to the 75,000 that I'm going to need for the Rookie Axe. That should be good. That, that'll be fine. Um, what did we do the last time? We were exploding things with TNT. And I got some TNT, but I don't want to use it. I want to save that for another special thing. I don't know. I have ideas. I have tons of ideas coming. Of course, most of the stuff that I think of is usually random and usually about five minutes prior to me in like recording anything. So, for the most part, it's just me playing. Wee! Let's just turn it around here. There we go. Sweet. Sweet. <clears throat> so, I hope everybody's had a great weekend and had fun for their Monday back. I know I did. Um. Speaking of which, if you guys don't know what Dungeons and Dragons is, Dungeons and Dragons is like the most nerdiest, geekiest, geekiest thing that you could possibly do. And we went out to a comic book store. I won't say which one, but it sells used games and old Nintendo stuff and all kinds of just cool things, right? And while we were there, I saw a uh, Dungeons and Dragons starter kit, and I'm like. I played Dungeons and Dragons before. I, I played that in high school and everything else. And what's weird is like, it wasn't nerdy. <laughs> it was one of these things that's like, I don't, I don't know, it's different. Because me and a lot of my friends played Dungeons and Dragons and I would usually be the dungeon master. Like the, the guy that would come up with the stories and the, create the adventures and everything else. and. We would make an all-night party of it. Like, it was awesome. We'd have pizza. We'd order pizza and have sodas, and like it was, it was really fun to me and all my friends. Um, by the way, that's when I wasn't out skating or break dancing or doing something crazy back in my youth, back in the day. So, just so you know, I've done a lot of things throughout my lifetime, and I've never been considered a geek or a nerd or a jock or anything like really but now that I look at myself I'm like wow I really am a, a nerd <laughs> so and I'm proud of it I'm very proud of it so for all of those that are commenting nerd in my comments right now I know who you are thank you and yes I will admit it I am a nerd I am a geek and I love it so if you are a nerd or a geek and you are proud of it write it in the comment below that I am a nerd, or no, no, put down uh, nerd power. Yeah, hashtag nerd power. There you go. And nerds of the world unite. Anyhow, uh, long story short, we found a Dungeons and Dragons starter kit and I purchased it. And my wife's like, you're not buying that, are you? I'm like, yeah, I'm buying this. This is awesome. She's like, well, 
it's so expensive. I'm like, it's 20 bucks. So we ended up spending $20 on a Dungeons and Dragons starter kit that came with pre-rolled characters and an adventure and all kinds of good stuff. And me and the kids sat down tonight and actually walked through the first part. And it was awesome. So, um, I was worried that it wouldn't keep their interest at all because it's a lot of reading and a lot of rules and my kids are very short attention span just like I am. So I kind of skipped over a couple of the rules but I did my dungeon mastery thing where I'd like make up stories and make up the scene as they imagined it. And basically it's like storytelling with a storybook only they get to choose the directions of which ways to go. So. I have ideas for actually starting Dungeons and Dragons. No, this is too big. I can't get it in there. Come on, seriously. Please, just get in there. I have an idea for starting Dungeons and Dragons inside my Discord, having a Dungeons and Dragons room of some kind. I don't know how well that's gonna go over, but it's a thought, it's an idea. If you guys wanted to see what it's like, I could probably make a video about it. But I don't want to get too excited about like doing a Dungeons and Dragons theme thingy. But I mean, oh gosh, oh man, oh come on, there was more to you than that, wasn't there? You didn't just stop, did you? Oh no. All right, move around, move around, move around, move around. Keep going, keep going. You're doing great. Can I grab it? Yeah, done. All right. Move those out of the way, press B. Good job, Code. Mm, that, now that I've spoken for, what, seven minutes about Dungeons and Dragons. <clears throat> Back to the Lumber Tycoon. I'm super excited to actually get the, get all this done. Like, this is, this is fun. Uh, didn't I say I was going to do Goldenwood last time? I did. I thought maybe maybe not because the white the the birch wood just doesn't go fast enough I don't think. oh no I missed the piece how did you, <laughs> little devil is it trying to hit your ride there we go throw that in there like that just just easy just get in there sweet <laughs> and right, drop that like that Drop this, like that. By the way, I am not as excitable or jumpy around like most YouTubers. And thank you for watching. If this is your first time joining me, please don't forget to hit a like and a subscribe and all that good stuff. And yes, I'm kind of begging for it because there are so many out there that are doing these giveaways and doing these huge like $25 gift card, blah, blah, blah. And I'm like, really? There's one in particular that I'm thinking of inside my head, and he is... Mm, I said he. Darn it. Okay, I can't, I, I can't talk bad about him. Okay, I can't talk bad about anyone else because it's wrong to talk bad about other people. That's, those are your co-workers, man. Those are the guys that like are working alongside you and doing, doing the hard work. Somewhat. <laughs> but... I think there's an unfairness inside YouTube. I will do my best to keep my channel as clean and proficient as possible. And I will leave the rest up to YouTube as they see fit. And to you guys, because I mean, you're the ones that determine who gets the attention and who gets the, the awesomeness. By the way, <clears throat> If you are looking to become a YouTuber yourself, go for it. Go start a channel. Go make a video. Do it. Don't wait for somebody to like set you up. Don't wait for somebody to give you a collab. Don't wait for a whole bunch of subscribers. Just go record. And go record because you want to, not because you feel like you have to or like you're trying to get a billion subscribers. That's not the goal of what you're supposed to be doing. You're supposed to be making content for others to enjoy and to love because you like playing it and because you like love, like you love playing it. 
Um, if I wasn't recording right now, I would still be playing. If it's on Roblox or if it's on Creativeverse, if it's on something, I'd be in it. So why not record it and share it with the world and show the fun that I have? I love these little cars. Not as much as I like the utility too, but the cars are fun. And I know we have our complaints about them. Okay, these cars will explode and throw a tire and they will jump the wood out of your trunk uh, trailer, but we love them and they're fun. Oh, speaking of cars, another one that was really good was the, um, the cars in Jailbreak. Those things are amazing. Oh gosh. Whoa. Ooh. 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 Oh gosh. Okay. I'm always worried about this one because this is the one that like makes me flip completely. Oh gosh. Nice. Alright, let's just go around this direction. And we'll get off at an angle right here. Good, good, good. Please don't flip, please don't flip, please don't flip, please don't flip, please don't flip. Or if you do flip, just flip all the way. Yes! Skills. <laughs> Woo! I love doing that. That is that is the most Oh, that is exhilaration right there. Just that that hoping that you you're not gonna flip and then landing it. That's amazing. Oh wait, didn't I find that you could just drive off backwards over here? Uh, I don't want to risk it. <laughs> I just want to get the golden wood. Get the gold wood and head back. We'll just have fun tonight. <clears throat> um, I'm just going to grab the tops of the trees. Because those are easier to cut and it won't take me so long. So just the top of the golden trees. And get ready for darkness. Boop, lights. And there we are. Boop, turn your lights back out. Sweet. All right, you. Um, right here should be good. Good. And this one. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. I missed. Thank you for your donation tree. I appreciate it. Good. Uh, that one, that's going to be way too long. What? what? Alright, let's chop off the ends of these. Oh, did that get both of them? No, just one. There we go, got both of those. And then we'll chop that, actually, just grab that. Will that work? Sweet, that works. And you go across long ways like that. Can I push that on in? Sweet! Sweet. Dude, sweet. There we go. And then that one looks good just as it is. That's a little tree. That one's not been growing very long. <coughs> That's good. Sweet. And turn like this. And like that. Boom. Uh oh. Did, I, did that flip? No. Okay. We're good. I'm gonna turn like this. Hit the tree. Hit the tree. Boink. There we go. Kind of like shuffle the wood back into the back of the car. Alright. We're gonna chop this one right about here. That'll be good. Man, that's actually really big, isn't it? Ugh. Wait, what? What happened there? What? Hoover! Where are you, Hoover? Just kidding. Alright, let's jump back up here. 
grab this. How much time do we have? We got about 16 minutes left. That's more than enough time to plank this stuff out, sell it off, and go grab ourselves a rookie axe. That's wonderful. Come on, come on, come on. Just, just do it, just do it. Click, click, click. Silver axe does not do as enough damage. Oh man, okay, and I missed too. There we go. All right, grab this. Stick it across long ways like this. Oh no, no. Dang it. Darn. Come on, get in there, there you go. Okay, nice and easy, you guys. Nice and easy. Easy, breezy, beautiful. Cover girl. That, that, is that, okay, cool. That works. That works. Grab this. Blink. New activity on jailbreak. Beautiful. <clears throat> By the way, I get notifications all day long as you guys comment in them. And most of the time, I'm like at work if it's throughout the week. So my phone is constantly going pudink, 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 which is awesome. Um, I did turn off the direct notifications, so anything that's direct doesn't ooh, come to my phone. Ooh, come on. Why is that not going in there? Uh, what about long ways? I'm going long ways. That's not working either. Hmm. All right, can we go on top? Like that? That's good. That'll work. Quite a good tree. Alright. Any more? There's one more right there. Could possibly take the tops off of. Ooh, don't hit. Don't hit. Hitting is not nice. Thank you. Alright. <clears throat> Let's chop these off. Right about here do you think yeah that'll be good because we don't want the, the the bins parts like these little parts right here because those are kind of a pain to cut and then you don't really get that much wood out of them four five six seven <clears throat> ten eleven come on don't stand on a limb as you're chopping it because you need to fall off too I mean, standard physics, right? All right, you go right on top like that, perfect. And you go right on top like, like that, perfect. That, perfect. That, not perfect. It's hanging down, all right, hold on. Swing this around like this, and drop, ooh. No, no. Turn back around. Stay. No. All right, maybe like this. Whoa. Like that. <gasps> yes. Perfect. All right. Here we go. Maybe. Oh, oh. No, no. Stay, stay, stay. That's awesome. All right, make sure that nothing falls out on me. Oh man, it's a lot of gold wood for a silver axe. All right, anybody gonna guess how much we're gonna get out of this? I've got 4,900, oh gosh, it was about to fall, this is good, no, silly, what are you doing falling out for, oh, oh, is that the problem, that one fell first, that's, that's what it was, Han Solo shot first, <laughs> oh, I probably just got a whole bunch of comments on that one, <laughs> Uh, or maybe not. Maybe maybe nobody got the reference. <laughs> you can just imagine kids now. Dad, what's that mean? 
dads are watching that going, <gasps> what do you say? <laughs> uh, mom, moms can be watching it too. I'm, I didn't mean to offend. Don't comment that. <laughs> what do dads have to say? I watch Star Wars. All right, off we go. Ooh, boom, nailed it. <laughs> oh, that is awesome. I can't believe I actually made that. Like, maybe I didn't make it. Maybe I am stuck. Rock it back. Rock it back. There you go. Rock it forward. Rock it forward. There you go. You got it. Nailed it. All right. Uh, how far along? T ten minutes. Oh, no. Ten minutes to, like, gather, chop. Come here, you. Let's... Okay. Chop you one time. Maybe. Why is it not chopping? What? What? Whoa! What was that? <laughs> the ghost chop. <laughs> Patented. <laughs> lag spikes will do that to you. Every once in a while you get a lag spike. And it's like, what just happened? That was weird. Alright, let's drop this like that. And we'll grab these little ones like this. And go right across like that. Not like that. Like that. Like like that. Zoop. Pick this up. That's a big one. Alright, we're gonna we're gonna save that one. Grab this one. The ones that only have like two, maybe three sections, those are considered little. Then these big ones, I don't even know if those are going to go through the sawmill or not because I did not measure them. Uh, buried face emoji. Oh, 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 oh. Come on. Get on there. Get on there. That's right. All right. Jump up like that. Oh, gosh. Hard hat zone. Smack me in the head. Whoa. Whoa. Got it all to fit. Nice. All right. Let's see if I can turn this baby around. Come on. Come on. Don't, don't drag. Are you dragging? Don't drag the ground. Now. Don't drag. Don't be a drag. Oh, gosh. All right, there we go. Now we can just take it on in. Take it on in. Woo! Boop. Nicely done. Woo! That was good. Boop. Use the tree to kind of scrape all the wood off. Uh, this piece can go on... No, that's not a chopped piece. This, this piece can go on in. There we go. Let's line this up. Get in there, sucker. It's a new found word of my son's. Sucker. Like, really? Where did you hear that, kid? Alright. Chop, 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 pop, chop. Oh, this is going to take forever. Come on. Chop. Chop, 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 chop the wood. Chop the golden wood. Chop, chop the wood. Chop the golden wood. Boop, 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 boop. Good. No, no, stop, stop, stop. <clears throat> Just hit it. I'm like, don't you move, whack. Uh, this might be too long. Might be too long for the sawmill. It wasn't too long for the sawmill. Grabbing the golden, taking our time. Chopping the gold wood is really just fine. When we have made our profit to be, oh, what a rookie axe I will see. Oh, it's coming up with something in my head. Chop, chop, chop in the wood. 
I could I could do like a song to like uh, I don't know um, lean on me. We can do lean on me. There we go. Chop, chopping the wood. I don't know. Ooh. Sorry, I'm getting notifications, but I don't know why. Oh, they're tweets. Okay. Thank you, everyone, for the tweets. I appreciate them. A lot of them are funny. Like code. Yes. I love you. McCall, I love you too. Zippo. Bam. Oh, there's another interaction of a tweet. Tweet, tweet. Hello, tweet. I can't see it yet because I'd have to click on notifications over there. So, I'm dedicating my time to you guys right now, the viewers. All of my time is dedicated to you. Can this go any higher? It can't, can it? Oh, darn. I'm like, man, if there's just an easier way to cut all this wood up, I just, I don't know if there's... Hmm, maybe not. <laughs> That would be interesting. Somebody comes up with a TNT sawmill. It requires at least one piece of TNT or timed delay of multiple TNTs to chop all the wood for you. Keeps it inside a bin and then um, like spits it out the other end. That'd be kind of cool. Just saying. If you have that kind of idea. And if you do come up with that kind of idea, just shout me back. Be like, yo, code thought of this, let's do this. And you really don't have to shout me back either. I mean, that's a free idea out there for anyone. TNT sawmills. Now coming to Lumber Tycoon 2. TNT sawmills. Find them at your local WRS store. My name's Tom, and I've got prices that are crazy. <laughs> you sure do, Tom. You sure do. Boop. Do, 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 do. What's that supposed to mean? Oh, wait, no, wait. He doesn't talk like that. He talks... Hello, sir. That's Tom. Come down to Wood R Us. I've got prices that are crazy. Aw, oh, thanks, Tom. Tom? Thomas? Where are you? I'm right here, sir. I, I think he sounds more like a... Like a Jeeves. Like a... Like a... Like a butler. Or something. Like like Batman's butler. That's not Jeeves. Who is that? Oh gosh. Alfred. Alfred was amazing. I don't care which Batman it was. Alfred is always amazing. <clears throat> was it Michael Keaton? That played uh, Batman? And Jack Nicholson. That that was the Batman I grew up with. I mean, that was that was the Batman. And then he played Multiplicity, where where he had those, uh, had clones. Clone number four was funny, or clone qu clone three, clone three. I think that's where I get the Steve thing from. Hi, Steve. Come on, Steve. We're spitting on bugs. I like pizza. <laughs> I love that movie. I don't know why. My mom made me watch it. It was one of her favorite movies too. Hmm. Good memories. That's something that I want to mention to you. Um, you are going to go through life and you are going to make memories. Door code. But those memories, as time goes by, will change from good to bad to, to awesome to good and how you remember them is the key if you remember them as a good memory then they'll become good memories if you remember them as a bad memory they'll be bad memories oops i didn't mean to chop that and to move that out of the way some memories you just can't make good but can't make good memories. No, no. Everybody's got an awesome memory. Like, for example, you guys have amazing memories. And I know a lot of you are sitting there right now, going, 
What? No, we don't. I don't have a very good memory. Yes, you do. You have a memory that you use all the time, and you don't even know that you're using it. Um, but the way that you study in school is wrong. They tell you, you need to study, 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 memorize, 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 memorize. Yes, repetitiveness will eventually turn into memory. It is not the most effective. The most effective thing you could possibly do is take and use what's called association imagery and emotion. And I've actually got a tutorial. Uh, it's kind of a hypnoto hypno hyp blah, 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 hypnosis tutorial on it. But... Don't go watch that one. Just just know that your memory is extremely good. And if you don't believe me, <clears throat> um, well, for most Americans, take me out to the... What's the next word? Ball game. Who told you to memorize that song? Who told you you have to study this? You have to get this into your memory. You have to remember this. Nobody. So why all of a sudden am I able to pull it up? In fact, you weren't even thinking of it right then. And if you were, you were probably watching something else. But the point of the fact of the matter is you just had memory that was recalled out of your brain and you brought it to, you, you, you remembered it because I triggered it. And that's memory that you, were, you weren't even thinking of at the point of the time that I was saying the thing. My point is, you have excellent memory. You have amazing memory. Every single one of you. If you're watching this right now, you have an amazing brain. And don't let anybody ever tell you that you're stupid or that you're dumb or that you can't memorize because you can. You just need to know how. So stop doubting yourself. Look to the future. Look to the awesome and know that you can memorize anything. And if you wanted to, you can sit down and study a test or study a study guide and take every single answer and memorize it pretty fast. And it it's, doesn't have to be boring. You can sit and memorize something. Um, okay, for example, when I was doing my college classes, I do not like tests. I despise tests because I get nervous. <clears throat> now. It's a nervousness that I come to know that there's no reason to be nervous because it's just a test and it's not the full weight scale of the entirety of what you've learned because there's also homework, there's there's pre-test, there's study tests, there's in-classroom stuff. There's tons of stuff to give you credit. And if you don't like school, get over it, okay? You're going to have to take school. Well, uh, but that's... Okay, that's kind of an understatement. You don't have to take school, but everybody else expects you to take school. So, why not make the most out of it and have fun? Learn memory tricks. Oh, did you guys guess how much I was going to make off this Goldwood? Did you post it down below? You might post it before I finish. Hopefully it's going to be over 7,000. 7,500, maybe. If I don't make it this turn, then I will definitely spend it next turn on the rookie. Anyhow. Thanks for listening to me ramble about memory. As you can tell, my coffee went out, so the ADHD definitely surfaced tonight. And my train of thought is definitely off rail. <laughs> I mean, I, was, I, I started on wanting to move the rock bridge. That turned out to be wrong. And then we moved on to, let's go get the Rookie Axe. And then I was like, well, the Birchwood's not really doing that much for me. 9,466 60, 60, 9, is our final number. Woohoo! Boop. Let's go ahead and park it right there for now. Stand up here on the awesome box of TNT. I probably should have taken a picture or something with the gold trees. <laughs> oh no! Um, yeah, I'll, I'll I'll take a picture up there. Anyhow, thank you all for watching this episode of Lumber Tycoon 2 with Code Primate on slot two as we're building and doing solo mission, which I think I should probably go back to Samper Life to do. 
but I really enjoy doing the solo and just talking to you guys. So let me know, know down in the comments below, do you like this solo mission where I talk to you guys and just express like a vlog kind of thing where I'm playing and talking at the same time? I don't know. I don't know what to do. Smash my face up there. Uh, latest video right here. And if you haven't seen it already, Defaultio gets the green box right there. Awareness of the screen. I love you guys very much. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe down below. You don't have to. That's just a suggestion. I love you guys.